how to style crop tops with a large chest or if they're just too short. Number one, get yourself a crop top that has a built-in bra. Number two, pair a bodysuit underneath your crop top. This makes it really work appropriate and really helps if you raise your arms. Number three, if you have a crop top that's just a little bit too short, pair a bandeau or longline bralette or sports bra on top. Number four, I've shared this one in my past videos, but pair a crop top over a dress. I just wanted to give you another example. I think it's really cute. And finally, if you feel like these tips didn't work for you, try taking an oversized shirt and tuck it underneath your bra. This is for sure going to help. Thanks for watching and follow for more. Five must have bodysuits flattering for a larger chest. One shoulder styles on a larger chest is so flattering, especially when it has ruching on the side like this one. Instead of a button up bodysuit, try a zip up bodysuit. It looks a little bit more sporty, but definitely worth a try. A fitted long sleeve bodysuit is a must have in everyone's wardrobe. Don't make the same mistake as I did and wear a nude bra. There are times when you want to show off your chest. Try it with this ruche bodysuit. It cinches in at your waist perfectly. And finally, if there's one thing girls with larger chests can rock, it's a deep plunging neckline. I'm definitely going to be rocking this one during the holidays. Thanks for watching and follow for more. Whoever said black and brown does not go together, let me prove them wrong five times. First of all, black and brown is a very high-end, luxurious designer color combo. This outfit screams Paris chic. For a more casual look, black is a perfect backdrop for your brown color to pop in your outfit. I mean, there's just so many different shades of brown, and I love mix and matching them with black accents. I also love going for an all-black outfit and letting my shoes do the talking. How cute is this outfit? I would totally wear it on a date. And finally, wear color combinations and outfits that make you happy. Thanks for watching! ways to style an oversized men's shirt.
Okay, so you want to know three ways to wear booby tape. Let's do this. I'm using the brand new. She comes in different skin tones and we love an inclusive queen. I'm wearing a tank top for demonstration purposes. For dress number one, we're going to do the crossover style, bringing the tape underneath in an X formation. It's going to definitely lift the girls. For a peekaboo cutout dress, you're going to do the bandeau style, nice and simple. And for a more revealing style, you're going to just do the pasty. Use more or less tape if you need it. Thanks for watching. Like for part two part two of how to use booby tape i'm using the brand new and she comes in different shade options don't forget you can use more or less tape depending on your shape and size for deep plunging dress with straps go for the traditional bra like look again i'm wearing a tank top for demonstration purposes but you would be doing this on your skin and if this isn't enough you need that uplifted look then use a tape underneath for a high neck backless style like these dresses i call this the x-men look but you just want to cross over like this and again a tape underneath for extra support thanks for watching and follow for more Style tip number four, three ways to style a basic white tee. Layer over a floral dress, add some white sneakers and a purse for a girly look. Option two, start with some denim shorts, add a blazer and a pair of heeled slides for a more elegant look. Option three, add some distressed denim, tie up the top, add a leather jacket and a pair of combat boots for an edgy look. Five fall and winter wedding guest outfit ideas. For a casual wedding, go for a mini dress with long sleeves. This olive color is perfect with a printed heel and I love the mock neck and long sleeves. For a smart casual wedding, I'd opt for an asymmetric dress in an understated color like black or navy. For a semi-formal wedding, I'd go for something with a little more texture. This dress would go well with a fur shawl for night. For a formal wedding or if you're bridesmaid, I'd go for something off the shoulder with a wrap style. And finally, for a black tie or glam wedding, I'd go for something long sleeves with a plunging neckline. Let me know what you want to see next in the comments down below. Wearing the same looks every day because you don't know what colors go together? Here are some easy color matching tricks. Monochromatic colors consist of multiple shades or tints of the same hue. It's easiest to manage and visually appealing. Analogous colors are next to one another on the color wheel and provide more contrast. The color combo will look rich and beautiful. Complementary colors are usually across one another. The results may seem bold but can be stunning. Try it with the accessories first. Like and follow for more tips. Four style lessons from Mrs. Maisel. One, matching sets look more put together. Two, make a splash with a pop of red. Three, never leave the house without statement accessories. Four, go bold or go home. How are you doing today? I'm the coochie man. I just pulled up with 10 hoes in the Dooney van. Zeke and Lou sitting in the spot trying to move some grams. Nigga told me I can't fuck his bitch. I bet Louie can. Oh, you got some dog shit, you the dookie man Niggas waiting on their unemployment, I just blew some bands